Yesterday, I sat down with Keith and his wife of 28 years, JoLynn. Now, Keith said JoLynn is such an extreme alcoholic that she drinks all day long, stopping to do little else besides use the bathroom and eat small amounts of food. A few months ago, when JoLynn needed medical attention, Keith decided to call the paramedics, but things took a drastic turn for the worse. According to news articles, Joe Lynn became hostile with police, who also arrived on the scene, and she was arrested for public intoxication. Now, after Joe Lynn returned home, she had severe bruising on her face and eyes. Keith accused the Alameda Police Department of wrongdoing because of Joe Lynn's bruises, an accusation the police department vehemently denies. Joe Lynn's arrest, her behavior and accusations against the police became an international news story. Here's what Keith and Joe Lynn had to say yesterday. My wife, Joe Lynn, is an alcoholic. These are the beers I usually drink. They're 24 ounces, and I usually drink about six a day. Last time was arrested, it became local news, and the story even went international. A grandmother from Fremont received these injuries after authorities took her to jail for being drunk in public. JoLynn asked her husband to call 911 so paramedics could help her detox and take her to an inpatient rehab. But what started as a call for help quickly got ugly. She wound up in jail. where she stumbled and slammed her face against the back wall of the jail cell. Keith, you got your hands full. You think? Why did you call 911 that particular day? Well, I'm not exactly sure which day you're referring to because there's been many times. Well, I'm talking about the one where she wound up yes. with two big black eyes. Okay. My thought was get her into an ambulance and detox her. Why not just take her yourself? There have been times when I've been trying to transport her and as I'm driving, she'll start to open the door. And all I want to do is drink more. I hate that this is happening to me. Can you tell me about this incident uh, that went on the news? I was afraid to go into the cell. I, just, I don't want to go into a cell. Then they just tossed me in and take off my handcuffs. That's what we're doing right now. Now I hit my head and I haven't been the same since. Will you take a breathalyzer for me now so I know what level you're at, so yes. I know who I'm talking to? Well, real hard. It says that you are 0 0.35. Which is bad. That's four times the legal limit. Will you please help me? If you really want help, I I'm here to help you. I'm scared to death. Now, li Honey. listen to me. Jolene, Come on. if please. you leave, you're Stop. not coming back and we're done. So if you want help, you need to sit in that chair and you need to stay there. You're sober enough to hear me, right? Yes. You called 911. Your hope was to get an ambulance Correct. that would take her to a hospital. And the police responded. And you think that they were perhaps abusive with her. Well, I, I don't know. know. They I were. didn't know exactly what happened. You what? I know they were. They all wear body cams. They provided us with a, a lengthy video. Sorry, take the hair out of my face. Here you go. Is that better? We're, we're going to take the handcuffs off in a second, OK? You're still hair in my face. Okay. Can I get your hands off me? Still hair in my face. Better? No, it's in my, in my eye. Is that better? Yes, yeah, thank you. For the meantime, I, we need a place to have you sit where it has a bathroom and no. stuff like that. Does that seem abusive to you? I'm not sure I can directly answer that. Sure you can. She's ordering the police around. Get the hair out of my face. It was like this female deputy was her personal assistant. Uh, 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 get back up there. You're wasting an opportunity. Can you sit down for a few more minutes? I have to pee. Let me be real clear. If if you don't want to be here, it's absolutely OK with me. You, no, I don't want to leave. You, you're going to blow this opportunity. Do, do you need to use the restroom? I would like to pee. If you need to take a bathroom break, I'll, I'll give you a bathroom break. And you either come back or you don't. Do you have a story or a question for me? Click the link in the description and tell me what in the world is going on.